Hi there, it's Laura here from makingcardsisfun.com and welcome to another card making video tutorial here at my YouTube channel and blog. In today's video, I'll be making a masculine card featuring the Tons Beer Stamp Set, so let's get started. I'm starting out by stamping the main piece of my beer, so the body of the beer using the Vanilla Frosted Cupcake dye ink pad from the ton. So this is my first layer. Then for my second layer, I'm using a color that is slightly darker. The color I'm using here is Beach Blondie. And finally, for my last layer, I am using Amber Citrine. For the handle of the beer, I'm using Crystal Pewter first. Then I am using Smoky Quartz. Making a masculine card is quite challenging to me because I always tend to use really cute images, lots of um, pinks and soft colors. But this time my dad actually requested a card to give to his colleague so he kind of challenged me to make a masculine card and even though I had a lot of fun making this card I do prefer making girly cards because I mean it's just so much easier for me okay so for my sentiments I am using the Roma Alpha steam set from the Tom and I'm going to let this card say hashtag thanks so I am using the short version, so I'm using T, H, and X. And to line up these alphabet stamps, I am using this plastic kind of grid um, to make sure that my letters are lined up perfectly straight. I'm stamping these using Memento Tuxedo Black ink, and then I am going over that using some kitchen flour to remove any static cling. I'm going to stamp that sentiment once more using Versamark ink and then I'm going to sprinkle on Neutral Ultra Shimmer Embossing Powder from WOW. This is a clear embossing powder with some glitter in. I know I am using glitter. This is supposed to be a masculine card but I couldn't contain myself. I had to add some glitter and I may or may not am going to use some sequins later in the video. But anyway, for my second part of my sentiment, I'm using some craft cardstock. I'm also prepping it using kitchen flour. And I'm going to steam that using Versamark ink and then sprinkle on white opaque bright, no, opaque bright white embossing powder from WOW. And I'm going to heat set that until it's melted. I decide to go with a really um, clean color scheme so I decided to go with white, craft, black and then obviously the yellow from the beer. I'm going to add some black paint splatters so I'm just going to cover up my beer using some low tack tape from Happy Doodle and then I am mixing a lot of water with my black watercolor paint and then I'm going to splatter that all over the cardstock. I'm also going to tap my water brush just to add some bigger splatters. The watercolor paint I'm using is from the Gonzai Tombi watercolor set. This is a big box of 36 colors, but I think that you can get these colors individually as well. The black I'm using is color 20. I adhered my sentiment on my card using tiny foam squares, and to adhere the finished card front, I am using the Scotch a foam mounting tape. This card just needed a little bit of an extra so I decided to adhere a couple of sequins here and there using the long fawn glue tube and my EK Success tweezers. I decided to use some clear sequins and some black sequins since that went perfectly with the color scheme on this card. That's it for now. Thank you so much for stopping by. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and click the notification bell below. I will see you very soon. Bye bye!